I don't know about you, but this is how I want the world to be. Kids that are carefree, confident, full of joy. Laughing, playing sports, as far away as possible from life's harsh realities and all the new dangers since we were kids. These happy elementary and middle schoolers all have one thing in common, one thing that changed their lives. But before I tell you about it, let me tell you a quick story. It's about Tommy, a middle schooler with a close friend he hung out with a lot. Tommy thought he knew his friend really well. Until one morning, he got to school and discovered his friend was absent and never coming back. He'd overdosed on drugs the night before. Tommy's world went dark that day. You might think this story is rare. It wouldn't happen here, right? But the statistics say otherwise. Did you know that thousands of American kids died from substance abuse last year? Not just a few thousand, 325,000. There are only 130,000 schools in the whole country, so that's an average of about three kids per school dying every year from substance abuse. That's beyond an epidemic. Why isn't anyone talking about this? Thankfully, someone is. It's a program called Biz Kids, and it stands for Believe in Sobriety, Believe in Solutions, Believe in Success. I'm so glad we discovered Biz Kids because it opened up a conversation in our family and made our children want to stay drug free. Now they have the tools to stay confident and know how to resist peer pressure. Studies show that if a child starts drinking or using drugs before the age of 15, there's a 50% chance that they'll become addicted. So Biz Kids is a small idea with a really big impact. We use games, play, music, artwork for proactive prevention two-day workshop that's fun for kids. They have a hands-on experience about how to stay safe. They learn life skills that are very important. And what to do, who to call, how do you step out of bad situations? The sad fact is every child needs these skills. You know, every parent wants to keep their children innocent, but they're already exposed to drugs and alcohol on TV, at school, and from the people around them. The Biz Kids workshops bring families together, and it's amazing how they learn to communicate and support each other. And that actually makes our workshop outcomes more successful and lasting. At first, I really didn't want to go, but Biz Kids turned out to be super fun. We did a lot of art, music, and games, and I learned ways to say no when other kids start to pressure me. We wrote letters to the Addiction Monster, and I got to read my letter to my mom and dad. And then we hugged a lot. I just want to be a kid. As a parent, I had no idea how to stop my kids from wanting to experiment with drugs and alcohol. But when the adults join the kids for the final afternoon of Biz Kids, we learn what they learned. Now, I feel so empowered to talk openly about how to make healthy choices. We have to stop this epidemic at the source. And that's what the Biz Foundation and Biz Kids is committed to doing. My own son, Nathaniel, was killed in an alcohol-related automobile accident. It's devastating and heartbreaking to go through something like that. And I believe that no parent or child should ever have to experience what our family did. Long-term results of experiential evidence-based programs like BizKids show a 60% reduction in drug and alcohol use among the children who participate. This is a real and measurable way to change lives, save lives, and brighten the future. We scholarship all the children for Biz Kids, so no one gets turned away. And we encourage every child to participate in a Biz Kids event, a two-day day camp workshop. After the workshop, the children get to download the Biz Kid app and play the Biz Kid game. 
It's a fun educational game that helps keep them confident and positive and remembering what they learned in the BizKid event. Every child needs life skills to resist going down the wrong path with drugs and alcohol. But to keep providing full scholarships as BizKids grows, they need your financial support. Thanks for teaching us about the addiction monster. Uh, th thanks for teaching us to say no when we need to. To keep these programs available for children everywhere, we need your help. Go to lovebiz.org.